in Dubai and heavy rain has battered Gulf states, causing flash floods with some places recording a year's worth of rain in a single day. Dubai's airport was forced to divert incoming flights for around two hours. Officials say there's still significant disruption to flights. Well, Nicola Dickinson lives in Dubai and I spoke to her earlier about what's been happening there. Uh, we have had uh, an unprecedented 24 hours. I've lived in the UAE for four and a half years. And as you've said, we've had our year's rains in uh, one day. So it started in the morning, you know, and the government had done a fantastic job to pre-warn everybody and their proactivity, getting everybody to stay home and work from home. And uh, unfortunately, sometimes you do have to go out. So I had to take a friend to the metro station so he could try and get to the airport and uh, make a flight, as we talked about, the flights were a little bit delayed. And coming back, the roads were terribly, terribly flooded. And um, I nearly didn't make it at one point. This road that you can see behind me yesterday was very, very, very deep. And uh, driving a Range Rover through that was quite hard. I could, could feel myself nearly stopping. And then went home, stayed at home, stayed in the uh, dry. But okay. of course, not many, not many infrastructures could cope with the amount of rain that we've had. So we've had floods, we've had um, be unable to get food deliveries, um, and just the community all trying to pitch together to help each other out to get through it. So, so Nicola, um, obviously you're saying that the road that you were on, which looks uh, like all the water's uh, gone, um, <laughs> has, was incredibly flooded. So just briefly, I mean, what has been done to try and get things back on track? I mean, it looks... Looks like good drainage, for example, where you are. Well, the palm is actually really, really flooded. And I think we had something like, you know, one year, one year of the rain in one day in 24 hours. So everything was very, very flooded. You've seen all the abandoned paths. The sunshine helps. There is a strong drainage in place. But also the tankers were out with the, the hose pipes and they were out just sucking all the water from the road and just getting the roads clear and safe for everybody to get moving again.